So we're gonna go ahead and drag it into the blue, not like this because that is just oversaturated. So we're gonna go ahead and place it in the blue just like that. So if I disable the color corrector, as you can see, that is the difference we make. <laughs> What's happening guys, my name is Alex. Welcome back to a brand new video. It is Wednesday, so that means a brand new Vegas 15 tutorial for you guys. And in this video, I'm gonna talk about how to color grade like a pro. So let's say that you have shot a cinematic clip, for example, or just a gameplay. It doesn't really matter what it is. It can always use some awesome color grading. So make sure to smash the like button down below for this tutorial. And I would say, let's get started. So as you can see right now, we are in Vegas Pro and I just have this uh, free stock footage from a city and what we're gonna do first of all is decide what kind of color grading do we want do we want just to spice up the colors just a little bit do we want to just spice up the brightness or the contrast to it I'm gonna cover everything of that in this video so we're gonna start off with the brightness and contrast so this clip might look a little fady and shady and a little bit gray so we're gonna fix that by going to the video effects tab and we're gonna scroll down all the way until we see brightness and contrast we're gonna drag the deep default one on top of the clip as you can see and we're gonna just go ahead and add a little bit of contrast as you can see that makes quite a big difference and I think that one looks really really nice so that's basically it for the brightness and the contrast really really quick and simple but now we're gonna go ahead and go to the color grading so there are multiple options that we can use we can use plugins like the BCC plugins we can use uh, the sapphire plugins the new blue effects plugins to make it really easy for you guys I'm gonna just stick with uh, the actual color balance and the color correction and it's already in Vegas Pro 15 that so you guys don't have to go ahead and install anything or uh, like install plugins if you want to install plugins make sure to check out the description because I've listed the sapphire plugin and the new blue effects plugin in there so you can go ahead and check it out right when this video is finished so as you can see we're gonna pick the color corrector and we already have some kind of presets we have red midtones green midtones blue midtones red highlight green highlight blue highlight remove yellow cast blue preset and a preset of mine that I created myself so what we're gonna do is we're gonna drag the default one on top of the clip and what we're gonna do then is we're going to decide what kind of color range we want do we want to have a little bit more blue as you can see right here for example or do we want to have uh, go a little bit more yellowy or a kind of pink purple ish or light blue or green for example well I think blue will, would really fit in this category of like uh, clips so we're gonna go ahead and drag it into the blue not like this because that is just oversaturated so we're gonna go ahead and place it in the blue just like that so if I disable the color corrector as you can see that is the difference we make now we also have multiple like as you can see uh, parameters down below that you can also drag to different areas so if you go ahead and want to change the sky color we can go ahead and drag it to there as you can see the sky turns red it can turn blue it can turn green but we're gonna also make sure that we will keep the sky kind of a realistic color so let's make that one a little bit more red ish and then at the bottom we can also choose you know the overall color and also mostly the sky so if, if we put everything to blue, it's going to look very cold and everything. But if you put that one to red, it's more of a warm color. And if you close it out, this is basically how it comes to look. And that looks really, really nice. And that's how you color grade like a pro. Now, obviously, if you go to the top, if you have these presets installed, we have many different uh, BCC color grading and everything like that. As you can see right here, we have uh, the BCC color balance so if we click on there and if you drag the default one on top of the clip it's going to open up this advanced box and you can really you can really add in like the red balance for example like a really hot sunset for example we can also use the green and we can also use the blue now if you're not happy with any of these settings you can also use the sapphire plugin or like the uh, the new blue effects or anything like that and like I've mentioned if you want to see these tutorials link is in the description so this is basically how you color grade like a pro guys it is a really short and quick tutorial but this is basically how to do it and I'm gonna let you guys finish and decide what kind of color range you want to go in because you can go in very different directions because this is just a stock footage of a city but if you have for example like gameplay you can just really embrace the colors and amplify them 
and that's how to do it. So this is how to color grade Laka Pro. I want to thank you guys for watching. Thank you for the continued support. I'll catch you guys obviously in a brand new video tomorrow as always on the channel. So I will see you guys in tomorrow's video.